Hello Prairie Ridge, it's Friday. Next week we're going to start our move into hybrid instruction. I encourage you very strongly to go to our district website and click on the hybrid learning link there. And it'll take you to all sorts of information about this change, the new schedule, the times, and a variety of other information. Speaking of information, I know there's a lot that's coming at you. I'm a Prairie Ridge parent myself. I'm also a Hannah parent and a husband parent. So I have a lot of information uh, that's coming my way. So what I want to talk to you just for a minute about is what do you need to know? What do I need to know as a parent for Tuesday just to make sure that that first day or Wednesday to make sure that first day goes smoothly? So just a couple things to keep in mind as a parent. Number one, your student needs a mask. It can't be a vented mask. It cannot be a neck gaiter or a bandana. It's got to be a mask that covers the nose and the mouth. That's an expectation here at Prairie Ridge every day for when uh, students and adults are in the building, okay? So please make sure that you are following that expectation. If a student comes without a mask or the mask happens to break, whatever it may be, we have extras here um, that we can provide as well. Uh, the other thing to keep in mind for Tuesday is student IDs. We need the students' IDs to be on them at all times. Uh, with the mask, it's a little bit harder to figure out who is who. Uh, the ID will help with that, and each student's ID will also be punched on their free periods if they have off-campus permission, so that'll be important for them to have as well. If they leave the building for off-campus for whatever reason, it's an easy way to take their mask off while they're outside, uh, so that would be important for them as well. Finally, the other thing to know is um, all, all parents should have received an email from the district that has a link to the symptom check form that you fill out every morning. I know it's something else, else to think about in the morning. I have to fill it out for myself, so does my wife, and we have to fill it out for our three kids. This link is really fast. It's a couple of clicks to verify that your student is not symptomatic. And then actually there's one little button on there that you hit, it will send your student an email and they on their phone can then pull that up when they get to school, show it, they've been cleared, they'll come right in, do a temperature check and they should be good to go for the day. Uh, so again, just a couple of things to think about here for Tuesday morning amidst all the other questions, feel free to reach out. But those are just a couple of things that as a dad, that's what I'm gonna be thinking about on Tuesday morning.